Hey guys, Anthony here with a tutorial on how to clone your voice in Clone Voice AI, which is an all-in-one voice app. So I'm logged into my Clone Voice account. I'd recommend using Google Chrome as a browser. Make sure that you are in the Clone Voice section. Then click on Choose Instant. Next, in this section, you'll see two options. You can record your voice within the app itself or upload an audio file like an MP3. So let's start with record with microphone. So I'll click on this button and it'll begin the process of recording. And you'll see this pop up asking you for permission. You can click here, then choose your microphone like so, and then choose one of these options. I'll go with this one, and then you start speaking into the microphone. Hey guys, Anthony here, and I'm testing the voice clone feature in the recently launched app called Clone Voice AI. I'm going to record about 15 seconds of my voice as a sample and I'm hoping that this new app will do a great job of cloning my voice. So as you notice, I click the pause button, but you can click the stop recording button directly as well. Then you can click play to preview the recording. And if you need to start over, you can click start again. And if you're happy with the sample recording, Enter your voice name in here. And then using this drop down, you need to choose a language. I'll stick with English because I recorded my voice in English. Make sure that you choose the correct gender. Check this box to agree with the terms of service. And then finally click on clone voice. It will then start cloning your voice. And within a few seconds, you'll be brought to this page. We will see the clone voice. You can use these buttons to preview, favorite, download, and delete it. Now, towards the end of the video, I'll show you the output it generated using the text to speech with this clone voice. Now, let me show you the other option. So, I'll click on clone voice at the top and then click on upload file. I'll navigate to my folder on my computer. I'll choose my voice over MP3 file and then click open. So here is the MP3 file. I'll give it a voice name. I'll leave the language to English and then choose the gender, in this case male, and then agree to the terms of service and then click on clone voice. It will then begin the voice cloning process and then bring you to this page. As you can see, this is the clone voice. And now let me show you how to use your clone voices. So I'll click on Create Audio at the top. I'll give it a name. Then I'll click on Select Voice. From the right side panel, I'll use this drop down and then choose the cloned category. So here are the two cloned voices that we just created. I'll choose this one. So here is the voice that we'll be using. I'll stick with English as the language. I'll enter my text-to-speech script into this box. And then I'll agree to the terms of service. And then click on Create New Audio. In a few seconds, it will then generate these segments. In this case, because it's a short script, there are only two segments. For each segment, you can use this drop down and then choose a specific emotion if you want to. And you can also use this drop down and choose to add an expression. I will cover these in a separate video, so I'm not going to choose anything here. I'll just click on Generate Audio. And it'll begin the process of generating the text to speech voiceover with the clone voice. And here is the voiceover generated using my clone voice. You can use these buttons to play or preview it. You can edit it. You can clone or reuse it. 
you can download it to your computer or delete it. So I went ahead and created another text-to-speech audio using the second clone voice. So let me play both so you can see how they came out. Hey guys, this is Anthony and I am testing the voice clone feature in Clone Voice AI, which is a new audio app that has many different features. One of the features is voice cloning. And this audio was created using one of my clone voices. So this is a voice recording I created using text to speech with the second clone voice I just created using the uploaded MP3 file. As you can see, it did a pretty good job with this one as well. So overall, the clone voices came out pretty good. And uh, let me play another audio that I generated using a deeper voice using another feature called the voice changer feature. I'll be creating a separate tutorial for that. But let me just play that so you can see uh, what I mean. In a separate video, I'll show you how to change your voice into something like this. As you can hear, this is a deeper voice. To learn more about Clone Voice AI and get it at a discounted price, check the link in the description section. Well, hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching.